autoimmune and these other syndromes and syndromes is a fancy word for a set of symptoms that are happening at the same time. So that might be pain, that might be digestive upset, that might be migraine headache, all sorts of things. So we want to restore regulation because autoimmune and these syndromes are a result of autonomic dysregulation. Peter Levine, one of our mentors and also the founder of SC, he really put this on the map back in the 70s when he realized that humans, we get stuck in our survival responses. I'm going to list a bunch of things here that fall under this category. Now this list is not everything. So GI problems, gut, IBS, Crohn's, fibromyalgia, POTS, that stands for postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome, migraine headache, severe PMS, severe cramping of the uterine area around your menstrual cycle, during your menstrual cycle, and it can also be for your entire month. Some women live with chronic pain in that area. Anxiety disorders, so severe anxiety disorders, complex PTSD, phobias, panic attacks, depression, chronic pain, kind of goes in with fibromyalgia. The other fancy word might be complex regional pain syndrome. So there's areas that just have severe pain to them. Poor circulation, Hashimoto's, which is more hormonal, lupus, even asthma. So all these things, and I'm not naming every single one, some people have cancer up here. That is an autoimmune problem, if we want to call it that. The system is not recognizing threat and getting rid of it. So what these things all kind of fall under is what's called a constriction and a dilation, an opening and closing of the vessels, of the organs, of the tissues in a way that's abnormal, either too fast or not at all, or all the time. And so there's these spikes, almost like a roller coaster ride that never ends. It's just up and down, up and down.